the hell are you doing calling me this early? You know what time it is here? I haven't heard from anybody since Tuesday. I'm sure everything's all right. I probably just missed their flights. Well, these guys are supposed to show up last night. McKinley, is there something fucked up here I should know about? No, not on our end. Listen, fucker. This better not blow up on us. One for many. That's what we were told when we were being trained. You had to believe the ones you were sent to eliminate deserved to die. You had to believe it was for the greater good. You couldn't allow yourself to question it. You had to have blind faith. I had killed four men in the last 48 hours and had one hit left. But I had a problem on my hands as well. In a business where I was taught to trust no one, whose story was I going to believe? A stranger named John Devine or my point man Skiles? A man I had worked with for 10 years but had never actually met. Designation? Golden Harp. <laughs> Do you like the car? I thought you might. I don't give a shit about the car. What'd you find out about my shadow? I'm leaving headquarters right now. We're working on it. You haven't seen him since, have you? No. I lost him, remember? Well, you still feel confident about carrying out the assignment? Do I still feel confident? Fuck you. If Divine was right, and these kills weren't sanctioned, then for some reason I was being used as the fall guy, and the call would go out. Kill cards with my photograph would be printed and distributed, and an army of hitmen, maybe even guys I had worked with, would be given their orders. But if I didn't do the job, and I let this poor bastard live, the outcome would be the same. Either way, there would be a price on my head. 